Yeah, Darth Vader, you can just like go go screw off in a corner. I'll send a Tartan to protect you, just in case. Taking out this guy. All right. Man, these fighters are pretty ballsy. You'd think they would run away, but no, they, they're just attacking me regardless. Alright, that's done. Moving into position. I'll have one interdictor just like screw off in the corner with Darth Vader. Where's my Star Destroyer? Oh, there it is. I copy. We'll be there shortly. Right away. Why is everything like shining so brightly? It's like they look like just big white triangles with some vague features. Reporting. Maybe it's the nebula. The the nebulae. Moving I'm not sure. That's another thing I like, is like um, each, each sort of, like, cruiser has its own, like, level that it sits on. Like, you can, you can see the Star Destroyer is, like, sitting below the Victory Cruisers. That's cool, so it's like, units can exist within the same space. That way, like, the Star Destroyer isn't just, like, hogging all the room and everything has to, like, dig around it. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it, Vader. This time I have actual... some actual support. So that's cool. These frigates are surprisingly resilient. Oh no. I am almost concerned. And look at this this baller. Really, like, I'm gonna get ya. Just like charging the frigates all on his own. I think my uh, frigates take damage over time in the asteroid fields. Not sure. Yeah, they they like take damage over time while they're cruising through the asteroid fields. Unfortunately. Go ahead and remove all the frigates before I take on the space station itself. Yeah, I don't think the shields protect against from, uh, like, direct damage, like asteroids. I'm not sure, though. Because I know that the way it's set up in the Star Wars universe is that there's, like, kinetic shields and then there's energy shields. Like, you can only protect against one or the other. That's why asteroids just, like, go straight through shields in the movies. Kind of like the, uh, like in episode one, they have like that big huge shield over the Fombas, like for the Gungans and such. But like, it didn't stop the droids from walking through. It stopped all the blaster fire, but it didn't stop them.
Wouldn't it be inconvenient if the huge rebel fleet just hyperspaced in over there? <laughs> that sounds like a likely situation, so I'm gonna tell him to come back. That's all. Thank you for the assistance. Gunship reporting. Heading out. We're picking up rebel transmissions from a nearby sector. They should be within range within moments. Move the fleet into the nebula to avoid detection. Oh, okay. Our launch bay has been destroyed. Move into the nebula. Our sensors are being affected by the nebula, sir. That's fine. Our sensors are being affected by the nebula, sir. Oh, he actually is taking shield damage. Okay, well, this this game sort of messed it up, I think. That's that's how it usually is in uh in the Star Wars universe, though. It's like there's kinetic shields and then there's energy shields. Like it's it's not both, usually. This is Blue Squadron initiating sector sweep. Roger that, Blue Leader. Standing by. All right, so I gotta make sure all my dudes are in the nebula so that they don't get detected. This nebula will play havoc with our torpedo Resume guidance. Too much. Come on, guys, go before they see you. Go, fighters, go. Ready to receive orders. Quiet. Too quiet. Didn't Intel report a heavy pirate presence here? Okay, everyone's hidden. Good. Everyone stop, stop flat. Okay, good. Alright, awesome. Awesome. I like how Darth Vader was like, talking all quietly, like that would affect things. Transmission to the princess ship and a confirmation tag. Up now. Capture her quickly. Go. Go get her. Bring the interdictors online. Well, my interdictors are in the nebula, dude. To block the rebel go, go, go. The princess must be dude, go. Interdictor, go! Uh. Waiting orders. My copy. <laughs> this victory cruiser was in the way, so my copy. So my interdictor was just like dicking around. Yes, sir. You go attack him. Reporting. Move to attack. I copy. Yes, sir. Okay, it looks like I only have the uh, the two battle. tartans. Yes, Commander. Attack! This thing needs to get out of the uh, the asteroid field. Okay, good. Gravity well generators online. Ready. And unfortunately, they're all gonna focus down, focus Sorry, fire on it. So I need to take them out quickly. Open fire. Open fire. Awaiting command. You need to get in range and use your tractor beam on her. On her and not her engines. There you go. Take out those fighters. For the love of God, don't let them take you out. Oh god. Um. Okay, they have uh, Mon Calamari cruisers out of nowhere. And everything out of nowhere. I find your lack of Darth Vader has to survive. Go. Take out those dudes. Okay, 
fighters go take out that Marauder. We've lost our turbo lasers. Yeah, we're losing a lot of things. Okay, they don't have any fighters over here that I need to worry about, so I'm gonna jump in and other Tartan Patrol Cruisers over here. Let's move out. I don't really care. Heading out. As long as my uh, Star Destroyer can get over there and capture her, that's fine. Our turbo laser batteries have been disabled. Regroup for another attack. The ion cannons are inoperable. She's trying to run. She's trying to run. It's not going to help. Yeah, all of you dudes go take out this Mon Calamar cruiser if you possibly can. Yeah, she's just like running for her life. That's yeah, fine, that's fine. They destroyed our ion cannons. Ready for duty. If I could possibly take out her engines. Take out their engines. That would be grand. Roger that. Target the ion cannons are inoperable. Yeah, because she's she's just outpacing my star destroyer, unfortunately. Ah uh, hell. They're going after my uh my interdictor over here. Roger that. Target those lasers. Form up. Sir, I... All right, the engine has been destroyed. Roger that. Form up. Now you guys focus on these guys over Target here. Target the lasers. Form up. Full of God Vader. I mean, uh. Captain, what's your name? Destroyer here. Our turbo laser batteries have been disabled. Our launch bay has been destroyed. They've destroyed our ion the ship. Has All right, been awesome. Fact, awesome. Awesome. We are on a diplomatic mission. You have no authority here to detain us. Your diplomatic immunity is worthless now, Rebel. Phew. We managed to capture, uh the rebel vessel before they could destroy my interdictor cruiser. So that's good. That's very good. The Death Star plans were not found in the rebel ship's memory banks. We are searching the nearby system. It's of no consequence. The Death Star has been completed and is ready for testing. Once we persuade her to reveal the rebel's location, we will test this station on their hidden base. A resistance mind probe is considerable. It will be some time before we can extract any information from her. Perhaps she would respond to an alternative form of persuasion. What do you mean? I think it is time we demonstrated to the full power of this station. Set your course for Alderaan. Mission log updated. All right. Construction complete. Now should I do this to end off the episode? Yeah, I think I'm going to. It'd be kind of rude to uh, just sort of leave you guys hanging with, the, with Death Star in tow. Now, is there anything on Tatooine? Construction complete. I kind of want to see before I land there. Construction complete. Yeah, I got enough crap here that I can auto-resolve if need be. All right, Tatooine belongs to me now. Building started. That was easy. Construction complete. Constructing. Construction complete. All right. 
go ahead and move the fleet somewhere. I'm going to take Darth Vader out. Complete. Construction complete. Departure vector set. Construction complete. Course approved. Construction complete. Constructing. Beginning construction. All right, let's see. I don't think there's anything over there, but if, if there is, then we have enough crap to deal with it. Let's go ahead and go over to Alderaan. <laughs> I like this too. Like the, uh, instead of the usual little arrow, you get like the oh, Death Star symbol. And it moves extremely slowly because the Death Star is extremely massive, I suppose. Complete. All right. A suitable demonstration of the Death Star's power is necessary. Princess Leia has unwillingly picked the target, her homeworld of Alderaan. Okay. <laughs> I like this too. Whenever you, uh... The rebel fleet has just arrived from hyperspace, my lord. It is a useless gesture. They cannot prevent the end of Alderaan. Oh hell. They have A-wings now. Oh god, they have a lot of shit. A lot of stuff, sorry. Oh, all of this stuff is garrison units for the Death Star. Okay. Well, hell. We're moving out. I'll bring in my stuff. Move out. We shall be there shortly. Let's move out. Let's go. Maybe this is what I was thinking about. Like the Death Star having its own garrison units of like four victory cruisers. Then I can bring in like my entire fleet. Let's go. Hi guys. So yeah, it's like all these cruisers, plus their complements of fighters, like, you know, and all the fighters associated with, uh, with the Star Destroyers, so it's like, holy hell, how do you even stand against this? Yeah, go ahead and try and, uh, stand up to the combined firepower of three Star Destroyers. Five seconds. I was like this too. Okay, the enemy base is in range. How do we activate the Star Destroyer? I'm not sure how to uh, fire the Star Destroyer's guns. How do I fire fire at the Death Star? Um, oh, here it is. Okay, fire the Death Star weapon. <laughs> awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Goodbye, Alderaan. She lied to us. The remains of a rebel base at Dantooine had been abandoned for some time. No matter. Any further resistance will soon be crushed. But what of the princess and her collaborators? They have been allowed to escape. You're sure the homing beacon is secure aboard their ship? 
I'm taking an awful risk, Vader. This had better work. So yeah, we took over Alderaan. Lord Vader, oh. I have a final task for you. What is thy bidding, my master? I have sensed that this rebellion is seeking in its final desperate hours to attack the Death Star. They have managed to consolidate their forces on five worlds. Destroy them. All of them. It shall be done. What of the Death Star, your majesty? Use its full destructive power against them. Mission log updated. Alright, will do. And we're sort of getting to the waning hours of... Well, I guess the waning minutes, in this case. Of the Rebellion. But... Um, yeah, you got to see what the Death Star is capable of with a full fleet behind it. And uh, I think next time we're going to end the Rebellion once and for all. So, this has been Super Vader Man. This has been uh, the Death Star in all of its glory. Now I thank you guys for watching, and may the Force be with you.